Tis the season for Christmas carols. Rudolph. Snow angels. Drinking hot cocoa by the fireplace while I caress my body while I wear my sexy silky negligee. And then I take two fingers and I- And gifts. Gifts? Yeah, gifts. Presents, cold hard cash. Okay. Here you go, Michael, from the both of us. Mm -hmm. What the f is this? They're your new underpants, Michael. They're not the right thing. I asked for a G-string in black. Ow! Ah! Nice boys don't wear black G-strings. Well, f you, and f you too. You old witches ruined my Christmas. All I wanted this year was a black G-string. Only sluts wear black G-strings. Well, guess what? I'm a slut, and on the 25th of December, I have my sluttiest night of the year. You're not a slut. You're more like the bird lady in Home Alone 2. Like the female gremlin. Or Father Time. No, I'm a slut in a black G-string whose bussy is ignited with the spirit of giving. Oh, honey, that bussy's more like the Polar Express. Girl, give it up. Don't you actually have to get dick to be a slut? Flicking your bean under the mistletoe doesn't make you a slut. <laughs> <laughs> You're both just jealous of me, okay? Because I get more play than the two of you combined. And guess what? Santa's been watching and he's been reporting back to me. Oh god, she's talking to Santa again. Don't worry, I put some Latuda in her eggnog. Oh, she's so much nicer on Latuda. Uh, yeah, I know. Yeah, <laughs> and guess what? You probably have Santa for a brand new hole since your stocking's been stuffed one too many times. No, bitch, I'm the one that stuffs the stockings. Wait, Pete, you mean to say you're the stocking stuffer? Yes, I stuff the stockings. Big, fat, juicy stockings. Are you sure? I thought you were the one getting your stocking pounded. Or at least begging to have your stocking pummeled. Yeah, or at least paying to have your stocking tore up. My stocking is tight because I'm a top! You're lying. Fine. I like both. I like my tree trimmed and my halls decked. My sugar halls. God. Okay, uh... Lucid, what does Christmas mean to you? For me, it means power, grit, action, and proving your worth. How does that have anything to do with Christmas? I'll tell you. I was at my office holiday party. I was their top earner. I just moved to Los Angeles after separating from my husband, John, a New York cop who was rough around the edges. Ooh! Oh yeah, he was a real macho guy. And I was moving up in the corporate world, and he didn't like that. So he shows up unannounced at my office. I guess to, I don't know, prove himself to me? Stupid. Soon after that, these thieves show up, and they take 30 of my coworkers and myself hostage. Thieves? Were they hot? Yes, some sort of German terrorist. 12 of them, and their leader, Hans. Well, they wanted to rob my boss of $640 million worth of bearer bonds. But little did they know that my ex John was creeping around the building using his cop wiles and training to kill off the thieves one by one. Pew, 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 pew. Wow. Well, after a whole series of wild events, with Hans killing my boss after he wouldn't give up the code to the safe, and then this dumbass reporter saying on live TV that I was the wife of the rogue cop who was hiding in the building, Hans takes me as hostage. A hostage for a German thief? Uh-huh. And now, Hans and I are creeping closer and closer to the roof. There's dust getting in my perm, there's sweat all over my breasts, and Hans has got a gun to my head when we run into John, and Hans threatens to shoot me if John doesn't give up. Or does he give up? No, because John has got a gun strapped to his back. John shoots Hans. Hans grabs me by the wrist, and he tries to drag me out the window with him. And if I don't figure out a way to get Hans to let that tight grip off my arm, I'm gonna fall with Hans to my death off the roof of Nakatomi Plaza! What the hell are you talking about? yippee ki yay mother Lucid! That's not your life. That is the plot to die hard. So I'm not a top corporate executive married to a New York cop? No, you're not. Oh, you know what it was? was I've been drinking Bailey's Irish Creamer since 9 a.m. Oh, great. So basically what we've gathered is that the holidays turn us into drunk, greedy, horny, bitchy sluts. Mm, yeah! I think I could cry. Well, what should we do now? <sighs> Sing Christmas carols and finger ourselves. Ah, uh, do you do hear what I hear? Voices. Oh, oh. Um, oh. sorry. Oh. What do they say? Stop this. Oh, God. Go home. Sleep. Oh,